Hey cycling community, this is Steve Grusset, the Cycling Greek. Later on this morning, I'm going to a family reunion. So I got up a little earlier and I did a solo ride. Three hours, endurance, tempo. I've been reading on this training program where you focus on easy endurance, recovery type of stuff, and HIIT, high intensity intervals. Nothing in the middle. The concept is that when people on standard training programs will tend to ride a little too hard on their easy days and a little too easy on their hard days because they're a little room from riding a little too hard on their easy days. So I played with that this last training block. I just did a little high intensity work, mainly endurance recovery. I wanted to see how I would do with that and then transitioning to my current block and how I would incorporate that in there. For me, I'm finding out that just stay, uh, staying on the two extremes is uh, not going to work for me at this time. However, it did provide some benefits doing this. I spend a lot more time in the easy recovery mode. For example, after I do my workout on the four lane, do my climbing workout, I usually, I would come in strongly back into the car. Now, I take my time. I keep it a lot easier. Uh, I also listen with other workouts. I have no qualms about going a lot easier. It saves the legs. Do the work only when you want to do the work. So in this training block, I'm making sure that I'm not killing myself. by trying to go hard all the time. But now those uh, endurance rides are, are starting to slip up into uh, middle endurance and tempo like it was today. And that'll be just for the one ride. Right now I'm still doing three days a week and the days are getting shorter. Hope you got benefit out of this. Remember, comment, like, subscribe. The Cycling Greek.